Good evening, Tony Goldstone. So if you have received one of these brown envelopes containing a so-called RPSS or Remedial Pension Savings Statement, I'm going to tell you um, where to start in under four minutes, um, starting now. So I'm just going to go over to uh, my brown envelope cam. Um, so I would suggest you start here, uh, print out this one page um, helper, which you can get from the QR code or from that URL, uh, bit.ly TG McLeod triage, um, and this should um, get you on your way. So um, there's six pages on the England and Wales RPSS, um, but I think you only really need um, the last page to get started. Um, and basically, if you answer yes to any of these six questions, um, you need to use the full HMRC digital service uh, to submit a claim. And for most people, that will mean refunds, um, especially if they've paid tax, um, annual allowance tax. So question one, um, have you had um, an AA charge between 1516 and 2122? So if you go to the summary page, that's these red bits here. Um, so if you've paid any via scheme pays, that's going to be there. But obviously the scheme don't know if you've paid any via self-assessment. So if you've not got any uh, in scheme pays, you'll need to check whether or not you paid any via self-assessment. Um, question two is just for uh, locum GP subject to annualisation. If that's not you, you can ignore it. Questions three, are any of your contributions higher between 1516 and 2122? So that's this bit here. So you just need to compare this column, which are the old amounts, and this column, which is the new amounts. Um, and if any of them go up, um, which mine don't, so if, you know, for example here, uh, 58 becomes 50, 37 becomes 13. But if any of them go up, you fail trial, you need to use the full tool. Question four, is your 22, 23 growth above 40K? So that's this um, yellow bit here. So if that's above 40K as mine is, um, that's a triage fail. Question five, um, is your net income in that same tax year, 22-23, above 190? HMRC have set it deliberately um, below 200K uh, to try and make sure that people are correctly calculating threshold um, and adjusted income. So if it's above 190, um, that's a fail for net income and you need to use the full tool. Question six applies to very few people at all. It's about people with private pensions that have already drawn money out of their private pensions, not their NHS pension, uh, and have carried on contributing towards a DC pension. Again, not their private pension. So um, just moving back. So uh, in one minute 30. Um, so ASMA are the Association of Specialist Medical Accountants. They cover about half of doctors in the UK. Forbes Mazars are a leading member. I would have liked to have done this as a user-led service, but it's just too difficult. Um, Every claim is going to be looked at by four Wisma's hours um, with two professional qualified accountants and a so-called four-eyed check, taking all the hassle out of it. So you um, sign up for them, um, do your normal engagement process um, as you do with any accountants, and they request all the information, submit the claims. So um, this is the tool sped up greatly because it's uh, 200 pages long um, for, for most people, depending on your uh, complexity. So basically the process is, is uh, four Wismazars will get all your data, accountant one will review it, uh, will submit it using uh, robotic automation technology um, to the HMRC digital service um, and then they should know what the output was before they do that um, and then they can compare that uh, accountant two that everything was as predicted and it looks like you're getting all the compensation um, that you're due. So if you're interested um, and want to sign up um, you can find out more about the service there. Um, this is the sign up form there using that QR. Um, the total cost of the service for people that fail triage is a thousand pound ink VAT, um, and that's fully reclaimable from the cost claim back scheme. So essentially, the service um, is at no net cost to you um, after you've submitted that claim. Um, hope that gets you um, started off. Please don't have nightmares about brown envelopes. Uh, many thanks.